Hello everyone. Welcome back to your English class. I hope you all are doing well and most importantly that you are happy. Today as we begin our new lesson, I would like to ask you to recollect the meaning of two simple terms that is a house and a home. Yes, I know many answers and ideas might have popped up in your mind. So, I would like to tell you that let's find the answer through a very small poem. The title of the poem is A House, A Home by Lorraine M. Harley. What is a house? It's brick and stone and wood that's hard. Some window glass and perhaps a yard. It's eaves and chimneys and tile floors and stucco and roof and lots of doors. What is a home? It's loving and family and doing for others. It's brothers and sisters and fathers and mothers. It's unselfish acts and kindly sharing and showing your loved ones you're always caring. So I think all the ideas which popped up in your mind when I asked the question the difference between a house and a home has been summarized in this poem. So my dear students, it is an accepted fact that there is a huge, huge difference between a house and a home. A house is just a building and what converts a house into a home is the love and care which is shared among the family members. And the chapter that we are going to discuss today focuses more on this theme. The title of the chapter is A House is Not a Home by Zan Gaudioso. She is an author based in California. She has contributed stories to and edited the famous Chicken Soup for the Soul book series. These books consist of short stories that seek to comfort and inspire readers. Now let's begin to read the story and understand this.